What's up, everybody, and welcome back to more of The Walking Dead Season 2. Today, we're going to be doing Episode 4, Amid the Ruins. And as of right now, Episode 5 has not been released, um, but I believe it is slated for the end of September. So, it'll only be about a month until we finish the entire series. So, let's get right into Episode 4. Here we go. I'm so excited, and I just can't hide it. Previously on The Walking Dead. I can't even take care of myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? I wasn't truthful when I came across y'all at the lodge. Now folks are dead, and I can't help but feel I'm to blame. <laughs> Fucker. When you cover yourself in their smell, rub the walker guts all over you. I can't tell you from one of them. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good and covered. Go on. You don't need to see this. I'm not going anywhere. Slow motion save recap. Here we go. Yeah, you take that arm off. Right about now. Okay, we didn't get to see it again. That was a pretty epic finale, I have to say. Very interested to see what happens now. Maybe she'll bleed out, maybe she won't. This is Sparta! Ah! I just saved your ass. Oh crap. Well, maybe not. You can't die. I won't let you die. You have to move. There's too many. Come on, babe. She's dead, man. Leave her alone! She was bit. I had to do How it. Fucking dare you, Clementine! It isn't gonna go like this. Kenny! I won't be left alone again. We're gonna leave. We're gonna get out of this. Kenny! I don't care what you fuckers are saying. You're gonna be fine. I can't make it without you. We we'll have to let her go. I'm sorry. I love you. Kenny! Damn it, man! Come on! No way, Clementine. No fucking right! Kenny, you're not as smart as I thought you were. You should know better. You remember what happened to Duck? Come on, damn it. Click the arm. Oh my lord. Slow mo zombie. Oh. Everybody's getting shot to shit here. I don't think we've seen this many people die in such a short span of time in this game. And in the first game. Get off of me. But it definitely holds true to the comic book, so that makes me happy. If you guys haven't read Kirkman's Walking Dead, you really should. It's very good. I have every single issue of it, and I'm all caught up. Anybody? I don't care who it is. Somebody. Thank God. Can you find anybody? I know. What do we do? I'm almost with me, but... Uh, we're still fine. We're still covered in walker guts. I'm glad you're here. We can watch each other's back. It's gonna be okay. 
way. We're gonna make it. Okay. Zombie mosh pit. Maybe they're thinning out somewhere. Do you see any openings? Anything? Oh, there. Uh, this is like a game of Frogger. A really messed up game of Frogger. Oh, there we go. The way you shot. Damn it. Go back, go back. Oh. Jane. Jane. Oh, stop. Relax. You need to walk slowly. You'll be fine. I can't do this. You have to help us. <laughs> We can't clump together like this. It's better if we spread out. You two will be fine. No, you don't understand. Just mm. You guys are fine. Just go. You think we should spread out? We'll spread out. I can't run with the baby on my own. I said walk slow. You run, you die. Come on, just do the monster mash. Damn it. We'll have to push through that cluster of walkers. And they're so many. We'll make a cow catcher. Uh, what? A what? You'll see. There. That one looks light enough to carry. I'm gonna get on the far side of her. I need you to get her attention. I'm almost certain that it's a trap. Uh, let's attack. Just because I don't like you, zombie. Not gonna bite anybody now, are you? Brilliant. Follow me. Just Stay like close. Michonne. If you fall behind, I can't come back for you. If you guys don't know who Michonne is, you need to read the comics or watch the show. She did the exact same thing. Essentially. Zombie mosh pit. There needs to be some metal playing. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Episode 4, Amid the Ruins. Stop for a moment, if you need to. No, no. I, I can rest when we're with the others. I can't rest now. Can't just stop. I need to make sure everyone else made it out. Luke, Sarah, Kenny. God damn it. What if they aren't there? If they aren't, nothing we can do about it. Don't even say things like that. Fine. Sorry. Jesus, I don't even know if we're safe. What if the herd is still following us? We're fine. It's been quiet, but who knows? Don't worry. We're okay. We'll meet up with everyone soon. We'll at least be safe, I guess. We need to keep up a good pace. I know. I know. Just, I'm going as fast as I can. I know I should feel glad that we escaped, but I just can't stop thinking about the others. How could I leave Alvin behind? It was stupid. What was? Escaping? Look, I know we all agreed to use the herd to get out, but maybe we should have been more patient. Come up with something better. It worked. If you can call that working, we could have... I don't know. Jane saved us. I don't know how we would have gotten out without you. 
You don't give yourself enough credit. I'm just saying that if people hadn't panicked, things might have turned out better. Of course! We panicked! We were scared! The plan was good. The execution was the messy part. That sounds an awful lot like you're saying it was their fault. What? No! No, that's not what I'm saying. Just... Ugh. Oh boy. She's about to pop. I have to stop. I'm sorry. I don't want to slow us down. Can I just have a minute? Uh, yeah. Take a minute. Thank you. <laughs> Alvin was supposed to be here for this. Is Alvin... He's dead is what he is. Thanks to that fucking madman back there. Rebecca, are you going to be okay? What are you going to do with it? What do you mean by that? Uh, sorry. Just making conversation. There was nothing. No. What do you mean by that? Do with what? My baby? I'm just looking at the worst case scenario. You and Clem won't be able to raise a baby by yourselves. Not out here. I just mean it's going to need food and, you know, other stuff. Guys, that baby is coming, like it or not. Fine. And then what? It's going to be helpless and you can't protect it. And you assume I won't be capable enough. Just because you're some angry loner who doesn't care about anyone but herself doesn't mean you know better than me. Hey, I've seen it before. Back when it started, me and my sister, we what? were... She died? I don't need your pity. You don't... You don't have the right... Jane! Shit, I didn't mean... Shit... Jane, wait. Oh, damn it. We can't just sit here doing nothing. I know, I know. They'll be here soon. Holy shit. It had been so long, we were starting to worry no one else would make it. Well, besides... Now, hopefully, we can figure out a plan. How's Kenny? He's definitely the one to ask about. I tried to talk to Kenny. He flipped out on me. He started yelling. Scary shit. I know. He probably didn't mean it. But it was scary. I've been nervous to even go near him. What? You think he's gonna shoot you? way he is right now? I don't know. Maybe. He's not acting rationally. He's just... He's not thinking straight. I should go talk to him. This is my fault. Hey, you did what you thought was right. That's all anyone can do in that situation. It was the right decision. She was gonna bite Sorry, the dust Shane. anyway. God, wherever you are, please forgive me. I can't be alone again. Hi, Kenny. Oh, Jesus. You think I don't know what y'all are whispering about over there? What's wrong with Kenny? Why is Kenny acting that way? Do you think Kenny's okay? It's all I hear from anyone anymore. I'm just worried about worried, you. Worried, huh? Well, that's nice of you, seeing as this was your fault in the first place. There was nothing I could do. Seeing how things turned out, I think I might have preferred if you do nothing. I tried to save her. You think because you're a little girl, you can just get people killed and no one will care? That because you're sorry, it'll all magically go away? That's not how it works. Not for the last time. Just get the fuck out of here and leave me alone. I'm going crazy just sitting here not doing anything. 
Just give it time, Mike. It's still early. Clem, how'd it go? Kenny's really mad at me. Clem, you can't just expect him to bounce back. That man's going through. At least you try. Still, doesn't exactly help us figure out what we're gonna do now. We got no food, no water. It's getting damn cold, and we're losing daylight fast. When the others get back, they'll know what to do. Luke will have a plan. I thought Kenny would have a plan. Mike, Bonnie. <sighs> Mike's got a point. You can't just keep sitting around waiting. Things are difficult enough right now, and soon you'll have a baby on your hands too. What, suddenly you're pretending to be concerned? Seeing you people floundering the minute things don't go according to plan has just got me on edge, all right? We should go find Luke, Sarah, and Nick. If they're in trouble, we might be able to help them. Clementine Power in numbers. Time. After everything, after all this, if there's any chance they're still alive, we need to take it. I'll go. Clem can come with me. Thank you. Listen, Rebecca, if anything goes wrong here, you got something to protect yourself? I've got this. You don't think I'd need to... I don't know, but you better keep that close. Come on, Clem. I got the impression Kenny was about to shoot himself. Let's hope he doesn't. Excuse me. Look, I'm gonna level with you. You should know that finding your friends, that's a shot in the dark. Well, then why'd we come out here? I wanted to talk to you, away from them. You wouldn't have made it this far if you weren't smart, but I still, I just gotta warn you. That group is cracking. I've seen it before, and, well, a lot of times, it's better to be on your own. I know you see what I'm talking about. You don't want to be here when they start turning on each other, turning on you. You know, bad stuff happens to you when you're alone, too. But your odds are better. There's nobody to watch your back. And when something does happen, there's nobody there to help you. How much help is Kenny going to be? What he's going through, he's more of a liability than anything. And Rebecca's situation is not making things better back there. You get enough broken people together, and all you're gonna get are broken decisions. How can you get along without trusting anyone? That's exactly how I get along. For what it's worth, I like most of the people in your crew. But groups fall apart. People get killed. Then why did you bring me with you? I'm just trying to give you the tools you need to make it. Like your jacket. It looks warm, but a walker will bite right through that. My sister Jamie had a good leather one. Wish I still had it. You could've. What happened to your sister? <laughs> Seems we always want to talk about the end, don't we? You know, being a big sister is, well, it's funny. It's really easy to be mean. Oh? You know, hide her toys, make fun of her bad haircut, give her the bad haircut on purpose. I mean, I did put the gum there. I figured I should get it out. Whoa, you really were mean. What could I do? She thought I was her best friend. I couldn't go unpunished. <laughs> Every summer we'd go to this amusement park in Virginia. But the best part wasn't the rides. It was that nobody knew us there. And I'd, I'd pretend we weren't sisters. Just friends. <clears throat> Jackpot. 